Good evening, everybody. How are you tonight? I'm okay. Good evening, teacher. Good evening, teacher. Good evening. Hello, Abel. Good evening. Aida, good evening. Claudia Rodriguez, Jose Blanco, good evening. So it's nice to see you tonight. How was your day today? Today is Thursday. Very good. Thursday. Seven, eh, perdón. Seventeen, brother. Uh, let me check. Yes, 17. Today is 17. August 17. August 17. Yes. So I hope that you have a great day today. Um, so yesterday we were studying simple past questions, right? Do you remember about them? Yes. Sure. Yes, right? Which one were they? Do you remember some of them? Simple. Okay, simple. We study simple past tense, especially activities that we did on the weekend, right? So then you say, what did you do last weekend? That was the question. What did you do last weekend? And then you say, um, you list, right? You listed the activities that you did during the weekend. So let's see if you remember this. Uh, let's see, for example, did you clean your house last weekend? Abel, did you clean your house last weekend? Uh, no, I didn't. No, I didn't. That is a great answer. No, yes. And let's see, Aida Marisol, did you play basketball last weekend? No, I didn't. No, I didn't. Very good. So, Ana Gabriela, did you watch a movie last weekend? Ana Gabriela, uh, did you watch a movie? Let me see you tell me. Uh, ah, yeah. Okay, okay. She is just going to listen to the class tonight because she is, okay. Oh, she is busy. Okay, another worry, Jose, too. He is driving. So let's see, Maria Magdalena, what did you do last weekend? That was the question we studied yesterday. What did you do last weekend? I worked on Saturday morning. Um, in the afternoon, I did the laundry. I washed the dishes and went shopping. Went to shop. Okay, very good. You, you did a lot of activities last weekend, right? Those were the questions. Question just indeed, and what did you do? What did you do last weekend? So yesterday, did you eat pupusas yesterday? You say, yes, I did. No, I didn't. Did you eat pupusas yesterday? Yes, I did. Ah, okay, that is great. So did you drink Coca-Cola yesterday? No, I did. Oh, did you drink horchata yesterday? Yes, I did. Ah, okay, excellent. Did you eat chicken yesterday? Yes, I did. Oh, I say, yes, I did. That is great. Did you eat meat yesterday? No, I did. Yes, I did. Ah, okay, that is excellent. So let's see. Let's solve the exercises on the platform. Let me share with you, and we are going to solve these exercises. Um, if you have already solved them, you can share with me the answers. So let me share with you this part and this one. This is the exercise we are going to do to start the class. To know, right, if you remember yesterday's question. So the instruction, complete this conversation question and answer. Uh, answer must be in simple past tense. Complete this conversation, number one. Which word did I need at the beginning of this question? And then I, which one? Stay. Do you stay home on sunny Saturday? Okay, excellent. So is the first, the second, or the third option to complete this? The sec uh, number three. Okay, number three. This one. Stay. 
Number three, and let's see the second. No, I. I didn't call. Didn't. Okay, no, I didn't. I didn't call my friend. Uh, this is the number one. The number one? Okay. Because draw, draw. No, I didn't call my friend. We, we drove to a cafe for lunch. Okay, the next one, number three. How? Did. Um, with the number three. Number three. Okay, let's okay. just number three. Let's see the next one. I uh, party. Everyone enjoy, but the neighbors, the noise. So what is the number two? Number two. So I have a party. Everyone enjoy it, but the neighbors didn't like the noise. Okay, let's just number two. A number A number five. What did you last night? Did number one did do didn't do number one and then I have number six. When love love it. Number two. Okay, number three, when in love, I went to the new Jim Carrey film. I love it. Thank you. Do you like Jim Carrey movies? Number they two. Are, they are so funny. Right now, let's see number seven. Uh, over the weekend, you say number two, did you do? Did you do anything special over the weekend? And then we have number A, yes. Yes, I, I shopping. Unfortunately, I all my money now. I'm number one. Now I'm number broke. Say number one. Yes. Yes, I did. I went shopping. Unfortunately, yes. I spent all my money. Now I'm broke. Les ha pasado? Se gastaron la quincena en shopping. No. Yes, I did. <laughs> <laughs> that happened, right? That happened. Se emociona uno comprando. Cuando viene a hacer las cuentas, ya se falta para el pasaje. So let's see you seen at the party. Did you? Number two. Number two. And finally, number ten. No, I. I was sick. No, I didn't. Number one. Number one. Number one. Okay, let's click on save. See the score. Okay, excellent. You got 25 of 25 points. That is an excellent score. Okay, no mistakes. Very good job. So do you have any question about how to make questions in simple pass to know what did you do last weekend? No, no, no. questions. Okay, very good. So we are going to have the listening practice, but in the review for tonight. So if you don't have any question, that was the last topic, right? What did you do last weekend? ¿Cuáles fueron sus actividades del fin de semana pasado? So let's start with today's topic. And for tonight, we're going to study what and where. Okay, uh, how was your vacation? This is the topic for tonight. How was your vacation? How was your vacation? What is the meaning of this question? Do you like vacations? Do you enjoy vacations? Yes. Yes. yes enjoy. Okay, great. So vacation, how was your vacation? La vacación que acaba de pasar, how was it? ¿Cómo estuvo? It was fine. 
it was fine, it was great, it was excellent, or you say it was boring, it was tired, porque le tocó trabajar. So it was busy because you did a lot of activities. So they were amazing, you say. Estuvieron genial. So what's your vacation? That is the topic for today. And this is the lesson object for tonight. By the end of this session, you will learn how to ask an answer equation using the verb to be in simple past. The verb to be in simple present has three forms, which are they. In presente simple, el verbo to be tiene dos formas. But I'm sorry, three. It has three forms, the verb to be, which are they? Uh, was, where, um, sería en pasado. Uh, okay, okay. Yeah. was and where is in simple past. Eso es lo okay. que vamos a ver el día de hoy. Sí. En presente simple tiene tres. Son um, am, um, are, am, are, am, is, and are. Very good. So, tres. Am, um, is, and also are. Three forms in simple past. Just two. Was and where. Was and where. Okay, before to start with this topic, I have this listening for you. We are going to listen and we are going to find the answer. Who had a boring time? Who had a good time? Who met an old friend? Who got home late? Then I have three names, Laura, John, or both. So who had a boring time? Who had a good time? What is boring? What is the meaning of boring? Aburrido. Yes. Aburrido. Tuvo, okay, ¿quién estuvo aburrido? Who had a good time? ¿Quién tuvo un tiempo genial? Who met an old friend? What is the meaning of this question? Who met an old friend? Met es el pasado del verbo meet. ¿Quién, quién se encontró con un viejo amigo? Okay, excellent. ¿Quién se encontró con un viejo amigo? And who got home late? Get home es llegar a casa. Who got home ¿Quién llegó late? tarde? ¿Quién llegó tarde? Excellent. That is the right translation. When we have a listening exercise, it is really important to first understand the question and also the answers, right? So in this case, we have names in the answer. We are going to choose the right names. So let's listen and tell me which are the answer. Pay attention. Listening. What did you do last night? Part A. Listen to John and Laura describe what they did last night. Check the correct information about each person. So what did you do last night, John? Uh, I went to my boss's house for dinner. Really? How was it? Oh, the food was okay but the people weren't very interesting. They talked about football all night, and I hate football. Then we watched some boring sports videos. I didn't get home until after midnight. Well, that doesn't sound like much fun. I had a great time last night. I went to a party and met an old school friend of mine. We haven't seen each other for years, so we had lots to talk about. We stayed at the party all night. Hmm, it sounds like you had a much better time than I did. Yeah, I guess you're right. Oh, who had a boring time? Laura, John, or both of them? Yo, John. John. John, right, who had a good time? Laura. Laura, and who met an old friend? Laura. Laura. Laura, Laura, yes, and who got home late? John. Bob. Bob. Both of them or just John? John, Bob. Bob. I think that just John. Okay, listen again to find out the answer. Pay attention. Listening. What did you do last night? Part A. Listen to John and Laura describe what they did last night. Check the correct information about each person. So, what did you do last night, John? Uh, I went to my boss's house for dinner. 
Really? How was it? Oh, the food was okay, but the people weren't very interesting. They talked about football all night, and I hate football. Then we watched some boring sports videos. I didn't get home until after midnight. Well, that doesn't sound like much fun. I had a great time last night. I went to a party and met an old school friend of mine. We haven't seen each other for years, so we had lots to talk about. We stayed at the party all night. Hmm, it sounds like you had a much better time than I did. Yeah, I guess you're right. Okay. What is the answer? Well, Aida say both. Aida Magdalena, do you still believe that yes, John? It's both. The answer is both, both, right? Both of them. Yeah. So John arrived home at midnight a la medianoche and Laura stay at the party all night. Toda la noche. Bueno, sí llegó temprano, pero al siguiente día. Ah, que Laura. <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay. Very nice. So, what did you do last night? Now it's your turn to answer this question. What did you do last night? ¿Qué hizo anoche? What did you do last night? Uh, dos actividades, two activities. What did you do last night? Y no vale decir, I slept. I learned <laughs> English. Ah, okay, excellent <laughs> sentence. I learned English. I learned English. <laughs> Which other activity did you do? Some sentence. I practice some sentence. Oh. Perfect. Very good. Anybody? What did you do last night? Took my Dean. dinner. Mm, can you please repeat your sentence, Jose Daniel, please? Yeah. Took my dinner. I cooked my dinner. Excellent. I cooked oh. my dinner. Took, tomé mi cena. Oh, okay. Take, o sea, the take. I took the my dinner. Took. Mm, okay, I took my dinner. Yeah. But in this case, I have the dinner. I have dinner. Okay. That is the right word. I have dinner. So we can say, I ate. ¿Qué cenamos anoche? Se dice, I ate chicken, I ate pizza. So, I cleaned my house last night. I made my bed. What more? I read a book. Um, I took some notes of, of the class. I had English class. So, what did you do last night? So, let's listen this conversation. And this is for tonight's topic, right? How was your vacation? Let's take a minute to read this small conversation and tell me if there is a new word there. Let's read, uh, read the conversation. Okay, questions. New vocabulary in this small conversation. No questions, no new vocabulary there. And then let me ask you, Kausin, what is Kausin? I went to Hawaii with my Kausin. Okay, yeah. What is this, the meaning of this question? Lucky you. Lucky you? What's the meaning? Suertudo or suerte la tuya, algo así. Okay, excellent. Very good. And how long were you there? How long we studied this, this question, right? How long? It's a period of time, right? Cuánto tiempo estuviste ¿Cuánto tiempo? Yes, excellent. Cuánto tiempo. 
Let's see the other weather. What's the meaning of this? What's the weather? Okay. El clima. ¿Cómo es el clima? Perfect. Eh, cloudy. Helado. O... Nublado. Oh, nublado. Nublado. ¿Cómo es? Nublado. Ah, ok, ok. Nublado, nublado, yes. Nublado. And amazing. The ways were amazing. The ways were amazing. Estuvo como grandioso. Mm -hmm. ¿Qué estuvieron grandiosas? Las nubes. Waves. Oh, las, las. Ah, ok, las, las olas. Las olas. So, the last word trip. So, what was the best thing about the trip? Trip, trip, trip. Es como viaje. Excellent, Kevin. Viaje, yes. And you won't believe it. What's the meaning of this phrase? You won't believe it. Como que no lo está creyendo. <laughs> okay. Okay, yes. No lo creerás. Well, something incredible happened. Algo increíble pasó. You won't believe it. No lo creerás. So they went to a surfing contest. Can you see? Can you surf? Pueden surfear? Can you surf? No, I don't. No, I can't. <laughs> no, I can't. So let's listen to this conversation. Yeah. Okay, uh, I don't have the listen here, but it is in the platform. So let's practice it. So Celia say, hi, Don. How was your vacation? It was excellent. I went to Hawaii with my cousin. We had a great time. Lucky you. How long were you there? About a week. Fantastic. What was the was the weather okay? No, really, it was cloudy most of the time. But we went surfing every day. The waves were amazing. So what was the best thing about the trip? Well, something incredible happened. You won't believe it. That is the conversation. Now pay attention to this. How was your vacation? That is the first question. So we answer, it was excellent. It was great. It was amazing. It was good. La parte negativa sería, it was boring. It was sad. It was. Uh, which other adjective can we use to say that estuvieron mal en las vacaciones? It was back. It was busy. And then, was the weather okay? I was sick. Okay, uh, I was sick on vacation. The next question is, how long were you there? How long were you there? And the answer is, about a week, un periodo de tiempo. ¿Cuánto estuviste ahí? A day, two days, three weeks. Was the weather okay? That is another yes, no question. No, really. It was cloudy most of the time. And the last question in this conversation, what was the best thing about the trip? ¿Cuál fue? Bueno, what was the best thing about the trip? So let's listen to this example. Here. Look at this question. Were you in Hawaii? Was the weather okay? Were you and your cousin on vacation? Were your parents there? How long were you away? And how was your vacation? Let's start with the first one. Were you in Hawaii? Then you say, yes, I was. Were you at La Costa del Sol in the last vacation? No. You... Okay. No, I wasn't, sería la respuesta. No, I wasn't. Were you at El Tunkovich last vacation? No. No, I, I wasn't. wasn't. No, I were, wasn't. Were you at La Ruta de las Flores on last vacation? No, I wasn't. No, I wasn't. No, I wasn't. <laughs> were you at the home last vacation? 
Where did you no, I was. Yes, I was. No, I was. Oh, yes, I was. Okay. Where, where did you at Sibarlan last vacation? Yes, I was. <laughs> yes, I was, right? Si fuimos a las ruedas las vacaciones pasadas. Recién yes, pasadas. I was. Every Just day. Say, yes, <laughs> I was. Every day, really? Oh, that is great. That was great then. You have a great vacation. Okay. I was. Yes. Okay. I it's great. I, say, I wasn't. <laughs> uh, was the weather okay? Was the weather okay yesterday? Estuvo el clima bien ayer? Was the weather okay yesterday? No, it wasn't. Oh, no. no, it wasn't. It was too. It was it... too. Raining. Oh. Raining. It was like... raining yesterday? Okay. In my casa, it, sí. It was raining. Okay, it was raining. So now look at the other one. Were you and your cousin on vacation? Then you say, yes, we were, or no, we weren't. Were your parents there? No, they weren't. Or oh, yes, they were. Now I have the other uh, question, which are information questions. How long were you away? So you say, I was away for a week. How was your vacation? It was excellent. It was excellent. It was great. So we have the contraction wasn't, which is was and not. Weren't, were and not. So wasn't, weren't. Say yes, I was. No, I wasn't. Yes, we were. No, we weren't. So let's practice this question and answer. But first, look at this information. The pass of P. Am um, and is in past are was, are is where. And then we have the structure of the equations. Was or where at the beginning of the equations. Then we need the subject, the complement, and the question mark. And look at these examples. Were you my student? Yes, I was. No, I wasn't. Was she sad? Yes, yes. yes she was. No, she wasn't. Were they late? Yes, they were. No, they weren't. Were. These are the short answers for was and were questions. So look at the following examples and answer them, please. Were you tired yesterday? Flor, were you tired yesterday? Tired is like... Tired. I'm tired today. Huh? Cansado. Were you tired yeah. yesterday? Yes. Yes, 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 I was. yes. Yes, yes, I was. No, I yes. wasn't. Yes, I was. Yes, I was. Okay, Aida, were you tired yesterday? Yes, I was tired. Claudia, were you tired yesterday? Maria Magdalena, were you tired yesterday? Yes, I was. Alfredo, were you tired yesterday? Kevin, were you tired yesterday? Yes, I was. Okay, let's go with the next question. Thank you for your answer. Okay, was your dad angry yesterday? Was your dad angry yesterday? No, I was. Ah, okay. Look at the question. Was your dad angry? Then we are talking about oh, your dad. No, then he we was. Are going... Okay, no, no he wasn't. He was. Oh, yes, he was. Okay, let's practice. Jose Daniel, was your dad angry yesterday? Uh, no, the no, no, he wasn't. Excellent. No, he wasn't. Aida, was your dad angry yesterday? No, he wasn't. No, he wasn't. Ray, was your mother happy yesterday? Yes, yes, she, she was. She was. Yes, she was. Okay, excellent. Was it cold yesterday? 
No, it wasn't. No, it wasn't. Uh, okay, now we have it, right? No, it wasn't. Yes, it was. Very good. So you say, no, it wasn't. Not lately. Were we ready for the test? Yes, I was. Okay, imagínense que tuvieron un examen hoy. And then you say, were we ready for the test? ¿Estábamos listos para el examen? Yes, we was. And uh, yes, we was. Almost perfect. Yes, Yes, we... No, we no, yes, we're ready. Yes, um, we're ready. Yes, okay. we're Yes, we're ready. Yes, we're ready. Yes, we're Yes, we were. Okay. Yes, we were. Okay. Yes, we were. Yes, we were ready. Yes, yes we were ready. We're. Oh, we're ready. No, we weren't ready. No, we ready. weren't. Okay. And the last one, were they from Italy? What would be no, a good answer? No, they, they were. were. No, they were. No, they no, were. They were. Oh, yes, they were. Excellent. Very good. Now look at this picture. Look at them. Okay, let's see him. Was he angry? Yes, he was. Yes, he was. He was. Yes, he was. Excellent answer. Then, was he happy? No, he, he was He was. No, he was. Were they happy? Yes, yes they were. They, yes, they were. They were. Yes, they were. Okay. They were. Yes, was she surprised? Yes, she yes. was. Yes, she was. Oh, why is she scared? Why is she scared? No, she the fifties. Fifty, fifty. Sí, se ya empezó a llover, ya casi no ando bien. Oh, I'm sorry, Aida. Where do you live, Aida? Queremos que llueva todas las noches también acá. En San Salvador. En San Salvador. Really? Ah. En San Salvador. Is it raining there? Yes. I live in Cuscatlán. Probably it's going to rain here soon too. Mm -hmm. uh, okay, now let's see. Uh, was it sick? Yes, he sick. Um, yes. He... Yes, it, it, it was. Yes, yes he... it was. It okay, was. excellent now. Yes, it was. Yes, it was. Okay, now look at the update. Were they, were they boring? No, they weren't. No, they were. No, they weren't. Yes. Excellent. Very good. So now I'm going to ask you one by one. Okay, let's practice in these pictures. Anyone want to start? I'm going to start. I'm going to listen. Let's see. Jose Daniel, are you ready, Jose Daniel? Jose I Daniel? <laughs> okay, very good. Were they angry? Uh, no, they... Where? No, they weren't. Excellent. Uh, where? Was, was he happy? Uh, no, he wasn't. No, he wasn't. Very good. Ahora es su turno de hacer la pregunta. Look at this picture and tell me the question. And I'm going to give you an answer. Was he angry? No, he wasn't. He wasn't angry. Now, this can you ask me the question? Uh, was it? Was it? Oh, was the dog sick? Yes, it was. Very good. Was the dog sick? Yes, it was sick. Very good. And thank you so much. You did a great job, Jose Daniel. 
Now listen, Maria Magdalena. Um, were they happy, Maria? Yes, they were. Was she surprised? Yes, she was. Thank you. Now it's your turn to make questions. Ask me a question about this picture, please. Was he angry? Yes, he was. He was very angry. Now about this one. Were they um, enjoyed um, the they trip? Were enjoying the trip? Oh, yes, they were. They were enjoying the trip, right? Thank you so much. Very good job. The last one. Any volunteer? The last one. Just one more. Any volunteer? Uh, hey, okay. Hey, sure. okay, Kevin, thank you so much. Was he sad? No, he wasn't. Really? Oh, 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 no. Oh, sorry, sorry. Yes, yes, he was. Oh, yes, he was. He was very sad, right? Uh, were they happy? Yes. Yes, were... they were. Yes, they were. Yes, they were. Excellent. Uh, now, let's see. Ask me the question about this picture. Okay. Um, was she sad? No, she wasn't. Now, about this picture. Okay. Um, was he angry? Yes, he was. He was very angry. Thank you so much. Excellent job. Now, let me ask you to you. Were you angry yesterday? Flor, were you angry yesterday? Where, me dijo. Were you angry yesterday? Where is... No, where's she? You, you, were you angry you. yesterday? You, Flor, were you angry yesterday? Mm. No. No, I wasn't. No. No, I wasn't. No, I wasn't. Okay, excellent. No, I wasn't. Uh, were you sad yesterday, Flor? You, were you sad yesterday? No, I was no, I wasn't. One last one, please. No, I wasn't. No, I wasn't. Excellent. Now, no, I wasn't. Were you surprised yesterday? No surprised. Uh, mm, yes. Yes, I was. Yes, I was. Yes, yes, I was. Okay, let's see. Maria Magdalena, were you sad yesterday? Yes, I was. I'm sorry to hear that. Were you angry yesterday? Uh, no, I wasn't. Were you happy yesterday? No, I was. Okay. No, I wasn't. I wasn't. No, I wasn't. Yes, sorry. No, I wasn't. Okay. Very good job. Kevin, were you surprised yesterday, Kevin? No, 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 I, no, I wasn't. No, I wasn't. Excellent. Were you happy yesterday? Yes, I was. Were you angry yesterday? Yes, always. No, no, no. <laughs> no, <laughs> no, I wasn't. You say, yes, I am always angry. Okay. Okay. That is great. Great answer. Thank you. And let's go with the last one in this part. Let's go with Aida Marisol. Aida, were you happy yesterday? Yes, I was. Were you sad yesterday? Yes, I was. Really happy and, and sad at the same time? 
okay. yesterday, yes. <laughs> okay, <laughs> you had a lot of emotion yesterday. <laughs> Were you angry? Were you angry yesterday? No, I wasn't. No, I wasn't. Okay, great. Um, nice. Do you have any question about how to make this type of question using was and where and how to answer it? Preguntas? Questions? No question until this moment. No question for myself. Okay, then let's practice in this. Uh, complete using the correct form of the verb to be. We are going to complete these sentences, okay? So, take a minute, read the sentences, and tell me, do I need was or do I need where to complete this? Where? Are you ready? Are you ready to start? Yes. Hey, yes, I am. No, I not. So, yes, I am. Great. I'm ready. I born ready. I was born ready. Nasi listo. I was born ready. So let's see. And number one, how long your parents in Europe? Is where? 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 Where your parents? Okay, how excellent. Long? How long were your parents in Europe? They. Where? Where? Okay. Okay. They were too. They were there for two weeks. The next one. Where? 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 Excellent. Were they in London the whole time? And the last one. No, they. They also went Where? to Paris. Where? Where? They were in They need were in this part. Okay. Look, there is a mistake in one of the sentences. What is it? Un punto extra el que me diga. What is the mistake? What is the mistake? There is a mistake there in one of these sentences. What is it? 10 seconds. One, two, three, four. Creo que, eh, bueno, creo que la segunda pregunta es A, ah, es R, R day. Or not? Uh, no, not really. But very good try. Six, okay. seven, eight, nine, ten. In the uh, tercera, uh, uh, ten number tercera. one. In the number one, mm, what is the mistake there? Uh, they were. Yes. Uh, no, were they? Ah, uh, sorry. No, it's a question. Yes, it is a question. Okay, the mistake está en la tercera oración. ¿Cómo deben comenzar todas las oraciones? R, con eh, el verbo. The uh, letter, the mayúscula. Capital letter. Capital oh, letter. Sorry. Capital letter, mm -hmm. yes. Okay, every sentence in English starts with a capital letter, right? So in this case, we need to, to have a capital W there. So, how long were your parents in Europe? They were there for two weeks. Were they in London the whole time? No, they weren't. They also went to Paris. Two volunteers to practice in this conversation. Thank you, Flor and Aida Ramos. Thank you so much. So, Flor, you are going to read A part, and Aida, you are B of this conversation. Can you please start? Okay. Yo ate y Aida B. B. Yeah. Yes. Okay. How long were you parents in Europe? They were there from two weeks. Were they in London the whole time? No, they weren't. They also went to Paris. Well, teacher went to Paris. 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 Yes. Thank you so much. So can you repeat with me? Europe. 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 How long were your parents in Europe? In whole. Were they in London the whole time? Whole. Whole. The whole time. time. Whole. Thank you so much. The rest was excellent. Thank you. Un aplauso para ustedes. Un aplauso for you. Thank you, Flor. Thank you, Aida. Then I need another two volunteers. 
Thank you so much, Maria. Magdalena, thank you so much, Kevin. Maria, you are A. Kevin, you are B. Can you please start? How old were your parents in your in your role? They were there for two weeks. Were they in London the whole time? No, they weren't. They also went to Paris. Okay, excellent. Thank you so much. And applause for you. You did a great job in this. Let's go with the next exercise. Are you ready for the next exercise? Yes, I am ready. No, I am not ready. Are you ready? Yes, I'm ready. Okay, so let's complete this using the correct form of the verb to be again. Let's see number one. It is a question again. Do I need was, where, where it wasn't? Where it? Where? Where? Yes, if you say where, yes, you're right. Where you in Los Angeles last weekend? No, I. Weren't. 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 Are you sure? No, I weren't. Wasn't. 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 Apostamos un billete de 20? Wasn't. Wasn't. Okay, wasn't is. Ya me lo, okay. Bueno, le debo 20 euros. No, I wasn't. I wasn't, son. Francisco, no, I wasn't. Like the oh. <laughs> okay. Uh, no, I wasn't. Pero como se devaluó, ya solo le debo una cola. So, no, I wasn't. The Un next one. Cero punto cero uno. Long. Then I need how long it. How long is it? No. Yeah, okay, the answer is. Uh, what happened here? That was not the answer. It was oh, it. Was How it? was it? I love it. And then next, it was great. And were you away mm -hmm. last week? And the last, yes, I, I was. I was. Yes, I was. Okay, so were you in Los Angeles last weekend? No, I wasn't. I was in San Francisco. Uh, how was it? It was great, but it was foggy. What is the meaning of foggy? Any what? idea what is the meaning of foggy? What is the meaning? Boring. The I word mean. foggy. Yes. Um, yes. Mm -hmm. Neblina. That is foggy. Were you away last weekend? Last week, sorry. Were you away last week? Yes, I was in Istanbul. Nice, two volunteers to practice in this one. I'm going to choose Jose Blanco. Can you? Mm, yep. Yes. And let me see any other volunteer. Me, teacher. Oh, thank you, Alfredo. Thank you so much. And then we are going to listen to Claudia. Claudia, do you have a question or do you want to participate, Claudia? Uh, no, I, uh, I participate. Oh, do you want to participate? Yes. yes. Um, okay, after Alfredo, please. Okay. And thank you. Can you please start Alfredo in? Alfredo in? Yeah. Yeah. Me? Uh, ah, Jose, Jose, Alfredo and Jose. Thank you. Yeah. Okay. okay. Uh, were, you in were you in Los Angeles last weekend? No, I wasn't. I was in San Francisco. How was it? How was it? It was great, but it was foggy. Were you away last uh, week? Yes, I yes, I was in Istanbul. Okay, excellent. Mm, very good job, Alfredo. An applause for you. That was perfect. And let's see, Claudia, and any other volunteer who wants to practice with Claudia tonight? One, two, three. Anybody wants? Me. Thank you so much, Abel. So I have Claudia and also Abel. Uh, Claudia, you are A. Abel, you are B. Can you please start, please? Okay. Were you in Los Angeles last weekend? 
No, I wasn't, I was in San Francisco. How was it? It was great, but it was foggy. Were you away last week? Yes, I was in Istanbul. That was perfect. And I for you to great job in this part. No question until the moment. No questions. Okay, now we are going to listen to this. Where did Jason go and did he enjoy it? Where did Barbara go? Did she enjoy it? So it is a listening exercise. We are going to listen twice and then you are going to give me the answers. Are you ready to listen? Yes, I'm ready. Yes, I'm ready. Okay, here we go. Listening. Welcome back. Listen to Jason and Barbara talk about their vacations. Complete the chart. Jason, hi, welcome back. You were away last week, right? Yeah, I was on vacation. Where did you go? I went to San Francisco. Nice. How was it? Oh, I loved it. What did you like most about it? Well, San Francisco is such a beautiful place, and the weather was actually pretty nice. Well, that sounds more exciting than my last vacation. What did you do, Barbara? I just stayed home. I don't have enough money to take a trip anywhere. Oh, that's too bad. Oh, not really. I actually enjoyed my vacation. I went to the gym every day. And I lost three pounds. Well, that's great. Good for you. Take on chance, listen again. Day notes. Just a minute. Want to quick this. Okay. Listening. Welcome back. Listen to Jason and Barbara talk about their vacations. Complete the chart. Jason, hi, welcome back. You were away last week, right? Yeah, I was on vacation. Where did you go? I went to San Francisco. Nice. How was it? Oh, I loved it. What did you like most about it? Well, San Francisco is such a beautiful place, and the weather was actually pretty nice. Well, that sounds more exciting than my last vacation. What did you do, Barbara? I just stayed home. I don't have enough money to take a trip anywhere. Oh, that's too bad. Oh, not really. I actually enjoyed my vacation. I went to the gym every day, and I lost three pounds. Well, that's great. Good for you. Okay, now, question number one. Where did Jason go? In San Francisco. I went, no, he went to San Francisco. San Francisco. He was, okay, excellent. Went San he went to San Francisco. He went to San Francisco. Great. Did he enjoy it? Yeah. Yes, he enjoyed it. He enjoyed it. The short answer? Yes, he loved it. Yes, he did. Yes, he did. Yes, he did. And where did Barbara go? He stayed at home. He stayed home. He stayed at home. She stayed home. Very good. She stayed home. And finally, did she enjoy it? Yes. Yes, she did. She did. Yes, she did. Yes, she did. What did she do on vacation? Do you remember? She went to the gym every day. Excellent. What was the result of going to the gym every day? She lost uh, three pounds. Excellent. She yeah. lost three pounds weight. Okay, that was great, right? Perdió tres libras en vacaciones. Nosotros aumentamos por andar paseando y comiendo. On vacation. That is nice. So do you have any question about the nice topic? Questions? No question? Okay, now let's go to the last activity. The, I have a question for you. That was the end of the presentation, but we have 
the last activity. And the question is, what did you do on your last vacation? What did you do on your last vacation? Did you go to the gym? You say, no, I didn't. No, I didn't. Oh, yes, <laughs> I, I went did. to a restaurant. <laughs> I went to a restaurant. Yeah. So what did you do on vacation? You have one minute to have to, three sentences, right? Three activities that you did on vacation. What did you do on your last vacation? You can say, for example, I stay home, I went to the shopping mall, I spent time with my family, I went to the park, I went to the beach, I visited my grandparents, I read a book, and so many activities. I cleaned the house, I practiced English, I cook delicious food on vacation. <clears throat> if you are ready, you can start. Just three activities that you did on your last vacation. What did you do on your last vacation? That is the question. I went to the several. Okay, very good Aida. I went to Sivarland. That is great. Excellent sentence. Anybody has a sentence? What did you do on your last vacation? Tell me. I went oh. to the park um, aquatico. I went to the uh, How did you water say? park. Water park. We say water park. I water went park? to a water park. Okay. I went to the water park. Nice. Ya solo le falta una. I spent. A I lot went of money. to the carnival. <laughs> I went to the carnival. That is great. Okay, excellent sentences. Uh, Jose Daniel, do you have your sentences? I spent a lot of money. <laughs> I spent a lot of money. Okay. No preguntaré qué compro. <laughs> Tell me, Jose Daniel. <laughs> you have uh, one sentence. Uh, I went to to shopping shoes. Okay, I went shopping. I went to shop. <laughs> oh, I bought shoes. Compré zapatos. I bought shoes. Oh, I went shopping. Very good. Thank you, Jose Daniel. Because of the time, I just was ask you two two activities. Abel, tell me, and then Claudia. I okay. went to the beach. Thank you. I read a book. Perfect. I went to the beach. I read a book. Excellent, Abel. Thank you. Claudia, tell me your sentences. On my last vacation, I stayed at home. I cooked desserts and I cleaned my house. Okay, nice. Very good. Thank you, Claudia, for your sentences. Those were excellent. Desserts. Tres leches. Volteado de plátano. Budín. Oh, budín. That is, that is delicious. Nice. And, and cheesecake. Oh, and cheesecake. Yes. And you cook cheesecake? Yeah, I cook coffee. Yes. Ah, okay, nice. Abel say, I cook coffee. <laughs> With my daughters. I cook maruchan too on vacation. Ah, uh, nice, nice, Claudia. Nice sentences. Thank you. Anybody is ready? Okay, if you have already participated, see you, see you on Monday, right? Tomorrow we don't have classes. See you next Monday. Enjoy your weekend. Spend time with your family. Do activities that um, that make you to have fun, right? Make fun activities. Spend time with your son, with your daughter, with your husband with your friends, enjoy this weekend, right? And see you on Monday. Y los que no han participado. Good night. Good night. Good night. Good night. Good night.
Okay. Bueno, el lunes, el lunes. On Monday, on Monday. Los que no han pasado. Bye, bye. Enjoy your weekend. See you next week. Take okay. care. Evening. Thank you. Bye. Good night. Good night. Bye-bye, Sumana.